Let us explore how to add and subtract integers. In this video, I will teach you two techniques. First, how to write subtraction of integers as addition statement and then how to add them with the help of counters. Well, there are videos in this playlist where we have discussed other techniques like adding them on a number line. Okay, let's solve this. The question here is write as an addition expression and then add integers. We have four similar questions. First one is plus 2 minus plus 3. Second one is plus 3 minus minus 4. Then we have plus 2 minus plus 4 and plus 4 minus minus 6. Well, in all these expressions, we have take away subtraction, right? So in the first step, we will write these expressions with addition. Now, subtraction is reverse of addition, right? So when we want to change subtraction to addition, what do we do? We reverse the sign. So that is what we will do in step number one. So we have plus two minus plus three. So I can write this as plus two, right? Instead of minus, I want to write plus. So when I do reverse, I have to reverse the other side also, right? Therefore, it becomes minus three. So that statement becomes an addition statement, correct? Now let's do the second one. Here we have plus three minus minus four. So this becomes plus three and we want to write this negative as positive. So whenever I write negative as positive, I have to reverse the sign. So we need to reverse this sign. So reverse of negative is positive. So that also becomes positive. We get positive 4. Likewise, you can do part C and D. They are very similar. Okay. So I'll continue with A and B. And I'd like you to pause the video, copy these questions, and solve C and D once you understand the process. Okay. So I think the first step is clear. How to write your subtraction as an addition right so whenever you do that you have to reverse the sign so you made plus 3 as minus 3 and minus 4 as plus 4 now we will use counters to add our expression we have plus 2 plus of minus 3 plus 2 means two positive counters so we have these two as positive counters Negative 3 means 3 negative counters. So let me write 3 negative counters. So these are my negative counters. So I write minus sign to show negative counters. Now we'll apply the zero principle. That is, plus and minus makes a zero, right? So if I add this, I'll get a zero. I get a zero there also. What am I left with? One negative. And therefore, this should be equal to negative 1. And that is how we can subtract integers using addition. I hope you appreciate it, right? Let me do one more. Part B, let's complete that part. So plus 3 means 3 positive counters, right? And plus, plus 4 means positive 4 counters. That makes altogether how many? 3 plus 4 as 7. So we got plus 7. So that is how we can take away integers using addition. I hope you appreciate this idea and it makes things very simple. So practice solve part C and D, write them as addition expressions and then use counters to add. Thank you and all the best.